Pinhurst Asylum was a house of horrors. In 1987, it closed after many lawsuits and investigations that uncovered the most horrific incidents. Children that were unwanted with things such as disabilities or being children of color were sent to live here. My friends and I decided to take a further look into the history and truly investigate this place to the best of our ability. We were talking to the tour guide earlier and it seems like this place is super active there's a lot of tragedy behind these walls. And honestly, it hits kind of close to home. We actually got, sorry, I just heard something. I'm alone up here. Um, Amy and Jared are here with me and they invited me on this trip. It's super exciting. I'm happy to be here and I would not be here without them. So thank you to Amy and Jared. We are kind of getting a lot of activity right now and that's cool because we just started and normally when I do these investigations, it is not that easy. It's not like in the movies, it's not like any other, you know, crazy paranormal TV show. I'm staying up here by myself to see if, you know, anyone's willing to talk to me. Is anyone here? Can you say your name out loud if you're here? Or make a loud noise? On Ghost Tube, we just got Door. My name is Jelly. I heard something from over there. Are you hiding behind a door? Is that you knocking? There's there's footsteps up above. No, I definitely heard footsteps. No. Holy crap. I can't believe they just left and all this is happening. I know I heard footsteps above. I am not just hearing things. I'm, I'm freaked out, honestly, but it's cool. I'm excited. This is pretty active and it's just begun. I'm in shock. Can you say your name out loud? It's weird because after they said door, I went to this door specifically. And that's when shit started happening. 
Can you make any more noise? Can you slam the door? Oh my God. Oh my God. Was that you? Y'all, I'm a little freaked out, but in a good way. The freaked out feeling that I'm having is really cool because I'm not expecting this at all. It's, this is already so cool. Thank you for talking to me. I am alone. Um, I can't wait to tell them what happened and show them actually That sounds like a, a, almost like a voice, doesn't it? Like something like, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's just the way the rain is making it sound, but it sounded like, almost like a man, like, like that. Didn't she say that, that yeah. sometimes you hear that? I, I heard a raspy male voice. Yeah. Say, I don't know what it would have been saying, but it almost sounded like it was growling out like, like Yeah. And yeah, that actually might be King. Well, you know what? King, I want to play my song. And you ain't going to stop me, I'm playing it. <laughs> oh okay, King, go please. ahead, Britney Spears. Like. <laughs> Britney Spears. Can you give me a few minutes to just get the tune? Hang on. A few minutes. Hi, Kiss. I kissed a girl and I liked it. Taste of her cherry chapstick. Good luck, Jared. So right now, Amy and I are down in the tunnels and apparently there is this, uh, because this spirit named Skippy, he does not like women. He has uh, allegedly scratched people, bitten people, and seems to be a negative spirit down here. These tunnels were used mainly for staff, but it does seem like some sketchy things could have happened down here. You know, it's a very isolated area. You could hide doing some not so nice things down here. Let's see if we can get Skippy's attention. Or well, anybody who may be down here, I mean, maybe your name isn't even Skippy. If you have a different name that you prefer to be called by, maybe you can tell us or just come out to say hi. Okay, I'm getting magnetic spikes, but I have been getting a lot down here. Yeah. Is that you, Skippy? Can you make a loud noise or speak through this device we have? We're gonna come look at here. It's here. What's it's here? here? Okay. Who's it? Like the clown? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Can you tell me your switch. name? Switch. Oh, switch. 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 What does switch mean? Like, there would be a, a switch down here to power something? Do you want us to switch positions? Like, to change? It almost sound, I almost heard a whimpering down there. I thought I heard it, but 
you know, my brain is saying there's so much noise going on that maybe I'm just hearing things. I mean, people have heard cries, screams, moans down here. Yeah. And I mean, given the history of this place, it's plausible that some nasty stuff happened. I'm hearing like voices and white noise as well. Yeah. But there is a lot of contamination because of the storm. But again, like there's so much water, there's so much energy from the storm too, so. Yeah. They also said that they've seen children's footprints without shoes on the floor. And we've been looking for that, but so far, I have not seen that. That would be pretty wild, but sad yeah. too. Yeah. I really hate the idea of children being trapped. I don't know if spirits are trapped. I'm open-minded about that kind of thing, but that type of energy in a child that was, you know, possibly miserable. At Pinhurst Asylum, which it wasn't really an asylum, but that's what they call it. The idea, because of the tragedies that have happened here, it, it's, it's really heartbreaking. Like, how is this one wet more time? <laughs> the whole floor is flooded. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. You know, I'm not sure, but it's weird because the first time we went by this area, I felt like a really heavy presence, actually. Uh, like, I feel like a heaviness on my chest now, even. Like, something is, like, weighing me down, you know? Yeah, it's a weird vibe in here. Nobody understands. It's the second time I've had something like that tonight. So earlier tonight in the uh, Mayflower building, I had, I want to leave, you won't or you don't understand. And now it says nobody understands. And again, I'm so sorry. I don't think we can understand what happened here and comprehend that. But I can sympathize with you. I'm sorry for what may have happened to you here. That, to me, like, hearing those words, like, you don't understand, love me, and based on the real story behind this place, it seems, like, residual more than, like, present, in my opinion. What do you think? Yeah, I mean, it definitely can be, like, I don't know that we've had anything really intelligent in the tunnel. Yeah. Yeah. We can't get past it. It's creepy. Like, is it that room just like a walk? I'm sure that's Jared, right? That's Jared. <laughs> That's weird. I think it was Jared. I don't know if that was him. I mean... So is the deck above here? Yeah, I think it was. <laughs> <laughs> that was that was creepy. Nice. We could hear you down here so loud. Yeah. Well, debunked. <laughs> I'm rolling on this knife just in case. <gasps> That was the noise, I just did it again! <laughs> I got you! <gasps> oh my God, I'm 
You're ro at least I'm you're rolling. I'm rolling, yes. You got audio on that? Uh-huh. I'm rolling. That is the fucking noise. <laughs> Could that be like, seriously? Yeah. You smell that? Mm-hmm. I said it smelled like fish earlier, but I'm guessing that's not what you're smelling. Fish. What could that be? I need to debunk this so I know it's like paranormal or not, you know? What the fuck was that? Oh, I'm so disappointed in this like, What in the world? Was that on this floor with us or was that upstairs, guys? I don't know what that was. <laughs> we were just standing and saying, oh, it's funny because I just said, I'm not getting much fun. And then all of a sudden it was like someone was running towards us or above us. It was really loud. And I think Joey shut herself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, practically. It was loud. It was loud. Like to me, it felt like a sudden energy. And it was like loud boots. So it was like <laughs> running at us. Yeah. And it passed through or above us. It just was like, like a... An earthquake in the distance, people say it sounds like a, you know, you hear it coming towards you and then past you. It was like that, but it was in waves like what it said, like boom, boom, boom. So freaky. That, it's probably the scariest thing that's happened to us all night. The, those loud footsteps we heard, I haven't found anything that could make that repeating footsteppy sound. Like, I, I haven't seen anything that could make that. And they've cleared this out as you can see, like there's not much around really in, in this building anymore. Like, I want to see what's up there. So right here, this is what the bedrooms looked like in this building in the 80s. Kind of like a jail cell. We've now come back to a room on the third floor of the Mayflower. It's too close to me. <laughs> so are you bring the activity, I'm telling you. We, that is the second time that, that happened to me whilst we were setting up. There's something about that locker. If you want to switch it, I'll sit next to it because I'm not going to be able to hear anything anyway. So. Um, after looking through the footage, we were able to debunk this and saw a piece of ceiling fall on the locker. We continued to investigate. We are doing a couple of this and on the SS in the spirit box. Joey has volunteered to use the lens and she's watching to see it. I see like flowers. Oh, you're seeing a picture of Joey? Yeah, I see like red, black and white, grayish flowers. Like, okay. yeah, I think. Interesting. Yeah. And then near I her. Near her. Are you near her? Are you, is someone in this room? Does someone like flowers? Are you trying to send us a message? It's for her. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. The flowers are for her? For me? That's cool. People just got a yes, that's kind of I, I just heard a flute playing. A flute. Right. So, you like music? Is there um, a particular type of music you like? Pretty. <gasps> oh. I'm sure it's maybe about you. I, 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 uh, It fell. No, There's no. two more. There's two more what? Near you. We've left out some candy on the floor here for you. Can you go up to one of the pieces of candy and you might be able to make one of the, the balls light up? Just look at me. We're looking. We're waiting. We're listening. Where are you? Can you show me? Can you go up to that device and that 
on that lady's head and you might be able to make it generate words that describe what you're seeing or what you're feeling or where you are, what you can see, what you look like even. An official list. Do you work here maybe? Are we talking something that works here now? I love something. I love Brie or... We do have the word love downstairs as well, which is interesting. Um, is there something I can bring to you? Something that you love, something that you like? Maybe you can walk towards me down the corridor over here as well. We've got some other wives that you might be able to make light up or play with. Can you show me who she is? Alan died. Alan died. Who's Alan? Oh, oh my God. I see, I see a, 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 a girl with long hair and like a boy who has like a maybe has a disfigured face. Oh my god. Yeah, and they have black eyes. And the girl is like holding her face like this. Right. Do they look older or younger or...? The, yeah, the, the boy looks younger, the girl looks a little older. He died. <gasps> I'm getting chills. I'm... and... Rewind. Um... Okay. Over a hundred. Is that how many people are here in this building still, or...? The Bible. I'm thinking of a number. We're friends. I'm thinking of a number. Can you tell me what that number is? If you're my friend, you can tell me what number I'm pointing at. Trapped. My lady. Can you tell us who that was? Was that Alan? Can you tell us about Alan? Can you tell us a bit more about what Joey just saw? I just heard a pop. Is that funny to you? Why is that funny? someone was sick or something. Oh. Are you not feeling well? Is that why you were here? Were you really sick? Doris or Dolores? I swear that name came up earlier actually. Was that who you showed me? There's people. Okay. Is there people in this room with us now? Can you tell us how many people in this room? With the three of us? Did, do they not like us being here? Are they angry? Are they upset? Yeah, you should. I should what? What do you want me to do? I, I see another... I see a hallway, that, like the hallways. Does it look like the hallways in this building? Yes. It does? Yeah, and it looks like there's doorways and hallways. It's like, that's what they're showing me, the hallways. Okay, cool. Go. Can you walk down the hallway? We've got some devices down there that you walk down the ladder. Over here. You want me to come back into the room? Thank you for showing me. Whatever you want. Well, what I'd really like is for you to come just have a chat with us. We're just here to talk and be a friend, that's all. I want to play rock. Um, rock? I feel like really prickly all around me, like there's something around me. Rock, do you mean like rock? I don't know or? how you feel, Joey, but I don't know. I feel weird. <laughs> I, I feel shaky because what I've seen and what she's saying. You're back. Oh God. I'm back in the room. I want love. We're here to be a friend. We can, well, I mean, we can be a friend. That's, you know, that's sort of what love, isn't it? Are you okay with that? You want us to play a game? We brought you some candy. Can you show me something else? Can you go up and tap one of these ladies on the shoulder? Either Joey on the oh. left or Amy on the right. Can you show me a black cat? I heard someone like, knock on a door. Wait, knock, okay. knock. I'm gonna knock on the door now. Can you knock back to me? A black cat? Yeah. Was that a pet, maybe? It's a weakness. It's a weakness. I wonder if they had pets here. Was there a black cat that you used to play with? Play with that. And that was a kid. Play with that. Okay, I'm gonna get a toy here. Which toy is your favourite one? Cat, I was like, the cat toy. Pussy cat. Maybe they need the cat toy. Oh, the cat, the um, 
There's actually a little light in here, like in the toy, there's a little light up. And ball that's just on. Oh, I just heard a noise in the corridor. There's someone down here. People are whispering. Can you show me what love is? Yeah, I can help. Yeah, can you, can you tell me about that room? I can see something happened in there. Can you tell me about it? Can you show us? Can you describe it to us? A doctor? I see. Whichever way. A doctor. Oh. I see something weird. I, I just heard like a dude, it was like he's being smothered. It was like, hmm, <laughs> Like, clearing his throat, maybe. You alright, Joe? What are you saying? I can't tell what it is. It's almost like it's blurry. I can't tell if it's a photo or a... It's weird. Oh, it's... It's it's like it's trying to show me, but it's not... At last. Then lock up. There's a bear in it. Then lock up. Lockers lock up. Is that what you mean? He's coming back. Who's coming back? I'm not seeing anything here. I'm looking at a toy in the locker. There's a toy in there. There are two. No, it's just one. Can you describe to Joey or to Amy what I'm looking at and, or what it means to you? Watch out. One more time. It yeah, said so like we repaid. I'm going to touch it. Can you tell us about the people that live here? Can you show us? Can you describe it to us? We want to talk? We're listening. We're here to talk to you. We're here to listen. Write it down. Wow. Ooh, I don't There's know seven of us. Ooh. Whoa. Okay. There's seven of you here. There's seven of you here. That's weird. Yeah. Are you children? Do you work here? Who, who are they? My parent? You're looking for a parent? Are your parents here? Ooh, what's that noise in here? Yeah, I heard it too. Uh, I mean, it looks like she's coming out of it. We may never fully know what these spirits wanted to tell us, but it was an intriguing experience. Would you ever stay at this haunted location alone? Until next time.